The World Health Organization has confirmed that evidence is growing on person-to-person -person transmission of the deadly new coronavirus. The news comes as a second case is reported in France. The new infection was discovered in a patient who had shared a room at this hospital in Valenciennes with the first confirmed sufferer. The SARS-like virus produces symptoms of pneumonia and can lead to kidney failure. Experts are looking at whether it's transmitted via contact or whether it's airborne. There are several incidences where a clear human-to-human -human transmission was possible. We're talking about a virus that is circulating around specific areas of the globe. As soon as we're capable of dealing with patients in the appropriate manner, the virus poses a very low risk of transmission. Two more carriers have died in Saudi Arabia where the virus was first discovered, putting the death toll to 18 with 34 cases worldwide. With a survival rate of less than 50%, authorities are taking the threat seriously. French travellers to the Gulf are being advised to wash their hands regularly and avoid contact with animals. Anyone returning with flu-like symptoms has been asked to report it immediately.